Boom. Monday's training. Monday's training. Let's get to this. So three things that we are not doing that if we were doing that I think would make a big difference to your life. And if you look at these three knots and turn them into do's, I definitely think you're going to move forwards. And it's not as easy as that, but you can certainly be more self-aware about them to concentrate on them and do something about them. First one, not finding personal space. So you are dealing with work. You are dealing with the commute. You are dealing with being a husband. You are dealing with being a dad, a mate, responsibilities. And everything's bearing down on you. And at some point here, you, do you know those feelings when you know when the wife and the kids have just gone off and you sit on a sofa and footies on on a Sunday, you just go, oh, oh my God. Where is that moment regularly every single day? All right. Not finding personal space is going to create a lot of like head banging going on, a lot of chaos going on in your mind, a lot of um, stress, frustration and overwhelm. All the things that put us away from being the best version of ourselves, all the things that create uh, distress and frustration in which your coping mechanism is to have a few beers and eat poorly. All right. So something that you can do and turn that around is by finding space in the morning, reflection time, transition times from work to personal space, finding just 10, 15 minutes just to process what's going on in your life, process the chaos, try and turn around the way that you're thinking. And that just gives you more time to think more about yourself. The problem is you're not stopping enough. You're not coming out of that rat race to just go, I need to think more about what I'm doing. Okay, the process, the ability to improve myself. All right, so that's number one. I'm going to turn that round, not finding enough space. Not prioritising yourself. Okay, you are not at the top of the list. So if we look at this little triangle here, this is you. Okay, you are at the bottom of the list. At the top is work. Then we're probably thinking about our family. Then probably other things that are going on like bills, friends, being there for everyone else. No, never being able to say no. Okay, like thinking more about others than yourself. And you, here's you at the bottom carrying all of that. And you are carrying the weight of all of this. And that's all the stress. What is a better pyramid is you at the top because then everyone underneath you or everything underneath you benefits. Okay, so your family benefits from a better version of you. Your work does because you do better work and you're more into it and you're more controlled, structured and, and managing yourself much better. And anything else is getting your attention. You've got your priorities in order. You at the top. You're not prioritizing yourself. So when you start putting yourself first, concentrate on your health, your workouts, your nutrition, your mental well-being, and that starts by putting things into your diary first, like your workouts, like your date night, like your non-negotiables, that are things that are important to you, that make you mentally happier and physically stronger. Okay, last one is not having passion. So when was the last time you were passionate about life passionate about getting up and, and getting to work and being passionate about the journey and being passionate about the success and achievement and trying to achieve something. So many people just wake up and it's like, oh, like, you know, that, that mo moping thing that we do. Not another day, another day, another dollar, another day, another problem. That's negative thinking. When are we going to wake up with, okay, passion, drive, obsession about yourself, purpose. I mean, really get that fire in the belly to go, you know, I'm up. And something I've done over time is trying to change the way that I think, my state of mind, my mindset is to wake up and think, bang, I'm looking forward to doing my show, putting my podcast up, getting my email, going for my run. It's all part of the bigger thing, of the bigger journey, of the end game, right? So three knots that you can turn into do's that I think will make a real difference into your life, your mindset, your state of mind, and how you reach the end goal of changing the way that you look, being mentally happy and being in more control every time. If there's any questions, please do answer below. Okay, there's 13 days to join the Brotherhood. There's 50% off for the first 20 people to get there. After that, we're closed for three months. No one will be joining our Brotherhood, okay, in 13 days. Uh, there's the discount code on there. Get on there, come and join us, come do some training, come do the mastermind, doing stuff like this, trying to improve the bigger picture. All right, guys, um, let me know what you thought of this. If it helped you, please let me know. Have a great day. Enjoy your Monday. I'll catch you soon.